take a look at this slice from a real meteorite. Do you see those little dark gray lines going through it? Those are what we call impact melt veins, and they're kind of like geological scars that tell the story of this meteorite. Let's learn a little bit more about it. This meteorite is a slice of an official classification known as Tassadet 4. It was discovered in Agadez, Niger around 2016, and quite a bit of it was found there, something like 400 kilograms in a strewn field spanning several kilometers. My little piece that you're looking at here is only about 20 grams. It's a slice of a smaller stone that was recovered, so a very small portion of a much larger mass that fell to Earth at some point. This meteorite is classified as an H5 melt breccia. It's one of only 46 meteorites of this classification. The H here refers to the high amount of metal, so nickel and iron that are in the meteorite, and you can see that kind of equilibrated throughout the meteorite sample here. Those little flecks of silver are metal, and we even see a few metal blebs, little blobs of metal that are distributed throughout the meteorite. While all the metal in this meteorite makes it look really neat, I think the star of the show here are the impact melt veins throughout it. We see those, those gray lines kind of going through it. Those are the impact melt veins. And what those are caused by is essentially some high heat impact event, either when the stone was ejected from its parent body or some other impact in space. That high heat event essentially liquefied some material of the stone fractured it and it ran into it and solidified. And that's what you see there. That's why that looks quite a bit different than the more brecciated matrix that we see uh, throughout the rest of it. That's kind of why I like to refer to impact melt veins as geological scars. They tell the history and the story of this stone. We don't know all the details, but we have some pretty good ideas of what happened, just maybe not where it happened other than out in the cosmos. If you like learning about meteorites in space, follow along. I've got a lot more space rocks to share with you. And check us out in the TikTok shop or on our website at midnightmeteorites.com. You can actually own your own piece of space for probably a lot cheaper than you think. Space is really within your reach.